Okay, so good evening everyone, good morning, or whatever time you're watching this video right now. So I'll just make a quick um, reminder on how to compute the concentration of the unknown. So take for example, you did your um, you did your uh, measuring already using your spectrophotometer. So what you're what you're going to get out of the spectro, okay, out of the spectro is actually your what? Your absorbance, okay? Your absorbance. And according to Beer's law, okay, diba? According to Beer's law, that your absorbance is equal to your concentration. So that is what we're going to calculate for um this video so the formula is actually um the concentration of the unknown your cu so let me write it down for you first all over as times the cs so what are these values all about okay what are these values all about so the cu is actually the concentration of the unknown okay this is the concentration of the unknown the concentration of your or your specimen or your sample the cs this is the concentration of your standard okay the concentration of your standard and this is actually most of the time known so this is known or this is given okay this is given so what about the au and the as the au and the as is actually being measured using your spectrophotometer so these two are the absorbance okay so this one now is the absorbance absorbance of the unknown okay absorbance of the unknown or the specimen you're currently measuring and this in turn is the absorbance of the standard okay absorbance of the standard so take for example i measured okay take for example i have a given so take for example i know that the concentration of the standard is already 80 um 80 millimoles per liter okay 80 millimoles per liter so i have that on me already and what i'm going to have is the absorbance of the unknown and the absorbance of the standard and how am i gonna get this i'm gonna get this by measuring it in the spectrophotometer so take for example the, the absorbance of your unknown is actually uh 0 0.561 and then the absorbance of your standard is actually 0 0.978 okay 978 so simple simple formula what you're going to do is to actually what to actually substitute the given so the concentration of the unknown is equal to what again here okay absorbance of the unknown which is 0 0.561 all over 9 0 0.978 multiply it now by 80 millimoles per liter so just do the math okay just do the math so 0 0.561 divided by 0 0.978 times okay times 80 that is actually what 45.89 millimoles per liter that is not the concentration of your the concentration of your unknown okay so we got the concentration of your unknown this 45.78 i hope this would help you so thank you and see you on my next video bye